Hi everybody, I'm going to present you a joint work entitled Syndrome Decoding in the Head, Short Signatures from Zero Knowledge Proofs. In this work, we propose a new code-based signature scheme built from a zero knowledge proof. To design this signature, we chose to focus on the syndrome decoding problem for which cryptanalysis is stable for many years. Then we used the MPC in the head paradigm to build a zero knowledge proof of knowledge for this problem. This paradigm provides a generic method to build zero knowledge protocols using techniques from secure multiparty computation. To apply the MPC in the head paradigm, we need to have an efficient MPC protocol that checks that a vector is a solution of a syndrome decoding instance by checking those two relations. The linear relation is easy to check with MPC, but it is much harder for the constraint on the Hamming weight. For this reason, we replace the second constraint with an equivalent one involving polynomials. This new constraint consists to prove the existence of a polynomial Q such that F divides the product SQ where S is a polynomial for which the evaluations in some public points give the coordinates of the tested vector, and F is a smallest polynomial for which which has for roots all those evaluation points. In practice, such polynomial Q can be easily built from the tested vector. We simply need to take a monic polynomial of degree W such that the non-zero position of the tested vector are encoding as roots. Now that we have the exact statement we want to check, we can use the usual techniques to build the wanted MPC protocol. Then we convert this protocol into an interactive zero knowledge proof of knowledge using the NPC in the head paradigm. Finally, we apply the Fiat Shamir transformation to obtain a signature scheme. We selected three parameter sets targeting a security of 128 bits. The two first sets rely on syndrome decoding instance on the binary field, while the third one relies on a syndrome decoding instance on a larger field. For each parameter set, we proposed two trade-offs. The first one lowers the communication cost and the second one lowers the computational cost. Let us compare our scheme with the other code-based signature built from zero-knowledge proofs. We can observe that the obtained signature size are less than for all the former schemes. We have the first such scheme, which can produce signature size belong the symbolic cap of 10 kilobytes. Now, let us compare our scheme with all the other code-based signature. We are far, we are far to have the shorter signature. However, our scheme outperforms all the signatures when considering the sum of the size of the signature and the public. To conclude, we proposed in this work a new code-based signature relying on the syndrome decoding problem for random linear codes. And the signature has competitive performance regarding the current state of the art. Thank you for your attention and see you on the 16th of August for the complete talk.